Karens are known for their public freakouts, and boy, do they deliver. They can be seen going off on anyone, from store clerks to restaurant staff, and even complete strangers. From screaming at the top of their lungs to pointing their fingers aggressively, these Karens know just how to make an entrance. So the next time you encounter a Karen in public, think twice before you startle her. She might just have something up her sleeve. What started as a typical patrol shift for a Dunwoody cop on May 29, 2022, quickly escalated into something out of an action movie. Picture this, a Hyundai Genesis driver decided that red lights were just suggestions and almost caused a crash with a police car. Fortunately, our quick-thinking officer dodged the near disaster, flipped on his lights, and tried to pull over the reckless driver. But to no avail, the Hyundai driver, channeling their inner Karen, thought it was a great idea to floor it and lead our officer on a wild high-speed chase instead. Let's see how that stupid decision worked out for this dumb Karen. Deciding that keeping the public safe was more important than chasing after a dopey runaway Karen, the officer called off the pursuit. But in an ironic twist of fate, once the officer backed off, Karen's car hilariously spun out and wedged in some nearby bushes. Don't you just love serendipity? Yet, the situation took an even stranger turn. The driver left the vehicle and ran away on foot. However, a young woman hurt in the accident crawled out of the wreck after suffering facial injuries from striking the windshield during the crash. Stay in the car. Stay in the car. He's not in there. Are you okay? No. Driver took off. Start AMR. Ma'am. Passenger. Please tell me you called the ambulance. Yes, I got one started for you. Where did... Do you know where he went? I'm on foot. It's going to be headed back into the wood line behind uh, Ravinia. That's what she's saying. <laughs> what was he wearing? We have a description. I don't even know. Stand by. Passenger doesn't know. No. No guns. He does not have a gun. What does he look like? <laughs> What's his name? Anything? Is this his car or your car? A couple of the old professories. What's hurting? What's hurting so I can tell the ambulance, ma'am? My head is spinning. I don't know what you're saying. Your head's spinning? Yeah. What's hurting? My 
my face and my head. Your face and your head? Okay. <laughs> How old are you? 23. You're gonna turn 24? 242 check on. The ambulance is gonna be for a 24 year old female. Uh, conscious alert breathing, complaining of head pain. What was that? Can you please get me away from the car? Yeah. Conscious alert 24 year old female, conscious alert breathing, complaining of head pain. Here, I'll help you get up, okay? Okay. Alright, you ready? Sit up. I'm getting her away from the car, that's all. Alright. She passenger side, yeah. Okay. Where did you go? In the bushes. Here, let's have you sit down over here, okay? Please don't please don't pull any guns on him, please. He's we'll get not, there when we get there. He's not like all right? he's not right now, I'm right you. now he took off from me. Okay. I know he's just scared. I'm telling you, Negative. he doesn't have any guns. There's nothing. All right, like sit down that. right here. Okay, sit down. <sighs> huh? Wait. What's your relation to him? Well, we got to have a description. He's still on my date. Who's driving him? Girlfriend. Most likely from that location. Made behind the bell. Was he quite a black? Ma'am. Check around from the other side. Ma'am, is he white, black, Hispanic? <laughs> Okay. Male's gonna be a black male. Unknown description. Is he coming up? Ma'am, real quick, do you have an ID in the car? The ambulance is gonna need it. He took your bag and the bag's in the trunk? Yeah. Okay. Come on. Let me clear this dumpster here real quick. Yeah. You may have spotted that the woman who crawled from the car's passenger seat is wearing an Atlanta Braves shirt. That's because she and her runaway boyfriend were at a baseball game earlier in the evening. However, when asked by the officers if her boyfriend had been drinking, the woman's amnesia all of a sudden came back. You already patted her down? Okay. Get you some light. I know. Alert on door, door K9, same as rings K9. Okay. We'll pet you between your legs again, okay? Okay, go ahead. That's negative on the K9 for standing okay. springs. Upper okay. K9, you hit us on a traffic stop at this time. Oh, my face. Okay. Yeah, you will be alright. Were y'all drinking tonight? Huh? Were y'all drinking tonight? I mean, I was, but I was with my friend, so I don't know, like, if he was. Okay. So, when did he come get you? Like we and where together. did he get you? We were together. At? We went to the Braves game. You went to the Braves game? Yeah, but okay. my friends were there too, so... Um, but I think my phone is in the back. I just want to call my mom and make sure she knows okay. I'm okay. Well, we'll, I've we'll let you do that. I've never been like this before and I'm so scared. Hey, we're gonna, I'm going to make sure that happens, alright? All right, you just got to give us time, all right? Because right now, the most important thing is yeah, finding him because he's probably hurt. That's a nasty accident, all right? Know, yeah, my so I don't want him sitting down here in the bottom know, of this hill. And I just, please, I just, I want to make sure he's okay, but please don't pull any guns on him. Please. He doesn't have guns. Hey, he's never owned guns. Listen, we got to take every precaution we need to. If that involves that, it involves it, okay? All right? I can't just promise say, you that we I'm will or we won't. I'm promising you that okay. he doesn't have a gun. He's never owned okay. a gun. He's never yeah, carried one in a car before. And he's right. never yeah. owned one. Like, you know, about I just know, like, my purse is in the back. Right like, I back seat or the trunk? In the trunk. Okay. I just, like, want my mom to know, like, I'm okay. Like, I've and never like been I, like in an I said, accident. Like, like I said, I'm going to make sure that happens, okay? But right now, i got to make sure he's okay. I don't want him sitting down at the bottom of that hill bleeding. Can I call my mom on your phone or something? I just, I've never been in something like this. I don't like, I got you. Okay. okay. Well, like, if, if, you're, if, you're, if, you're, if your phone is in your bag, it's in the trunk, I can get it for you, okay? 
No, not yet. Two forty two, start brown and brown for one. Hey, so um no, because it's not automatic. I could not find your phone. I did find your keys. They are in that clear bag. Um, if your phone is in the trunk, it's going to be a little bit before I can get to it. Because I can't get to the driver's side, and that's the only control for the trunk is on that side. Okay? I just, I, it's, it's covered in by all the bushes and trees. So, it is going to be a little bit if it is in the trunk. Yeah, I can let you go. Using the officer's phone, the woman contacted her mother. When her mother found out that she had reunited with her boyfriend, she was shocked and angry. Although the injured woman was initially hesitant to share details about her runaway boyfriend, she eventually gave in to her mother's persistent questioning and confessed reluctantly. What is, what's your mom's phone number? She's probably dead asleep. I really hope she answers. I ain't want to give up that easy, don't worry. Hello? Mom. Mom. What? I got in a bad car accident. My face is like all busted up and I'm in a police car. I was in the, pass I was in the passenger seat. Like the... <laughs> lost control of the car. And my, like, I, I smashed I my face against photo? the windshield. And my face is all busted up, but, um... <laughs> Did what have one? <laughs> I'm calling you off of the police officer's number. Okay, where's your phone? Where are they taking you to the hospital? My phone's in the car. They won't let me get it yet. Who was driving? Okay, Ralph is driving. Why were you with him? Because we got back together. Oh my god, Wait, Mom, Mom, this isn't the time to talk about that. But I'm just telling you, like, I just wanted you to know because I was scared and this is not Negative, no I've ever been in my entire life. Was well, he drinking? I don't know. I was with my friend Paige the whole time, so I don't know if he was. She stated she does not remember uh, every time I've asked. What are they doing with you? I don't know. Am I, like, being detained? Okay. Am I being detained? Until we can figure out what everything's going on, yeah. Mom? Yes? So... What do I do with that? Well, I, I guess I don't know what's going on, so... Obviously something has happened there, can you so wake up? See. Can you wake up, Phil? You can show Brown and Brown 26. He's right here. Alright, well... They... Pretty much... Can't... Locate... Him. So you don't remember anything at all what he's doing? I don't know, Mom. The last thing I remember, the last thing I remember is smacking my face against something and then all of, the, all of a sudden I'm on the pavement and my head is spinning like a thousand miles an hour. Okay, the fact so that I can even something. like spit these words out is insane to okay. me right now. Caitlin, Caitlin, I want you to listen to me very, very carefully. You're on speaker. That's, I don't care. I want you to tell them if you know where he is. I don't know where he is. Do you know what okay. he's wearing? I don't know what he's wearing. I just know he's wearing like leisure clothes, like just normal clothes. Like, like colors. It doesn't even have to be precise. Did like you dark, give him his light. name? They already know his name. Okay. And where were you coming from? We were at the Braves game, which I already okay. said. Okay. And you know, what, did he just take off after the page? accident? Mom, I don't, I literally don't know. I, like, literally, okay. I just know I, my whole body smacked, there was a crack in the windshield, maybe from my face. Okay, can I speak to the officer? He's right here. Ma'am? Yes. Can I still on speaker? Yes, you are. Can you take me off speaker, please? Yes. Ma'am. So, it sounds like you know this Raphael subject? And, um, 
she was dating him. He has not, in the past, has been very, um, like, we were almost going to have to file a report for, like, stalking, basically. We've had a lot of issues with that. And they were supposed to be broken up, not seeing him. And obviously, she's an adult. But um, I did not know that she was back with him at all. He is not somebody that we would choose for her to be dating. Okay. Do you know what he looks like by any chance? I know he's a black male. I don't know what he looks like. I could try to see if I could come up with a picture for you. If you could, Um, that'd be great, yeah. I could look and see if I can find something. There was probably... There's got to be something somewhere. She should have a picture of him. She's telling you. Is her phone in the car? Yeah, it is in the car. I can't find it. And she's saying it's possibly in the trunk. But uh, right now, the way the car is positioned, I can't actually get to the trunk control to open it up. All right. Um, Is she going to do it at the hospital? I got an ambulance coming out for her. Um, Okay. So. Just so you know, she has had two previous concussions that were pretty bad. She's had two concussions? Okay. Yeah, so if she did hit her head, then obviously that would be an issue. Yeah, Um, she hit her head because she wasn't wearing her seatbelt. Okay. Alright. So I'm sure he was probably drinking or whatever it is he does if he probably took off on foot because I'll be honest with you, he's a real piece of Yeah, he took off from me when I was trying to stop him from running the red light, so. Okay. Great. Oh, so that's how the accident happened. He tried to take off from you. Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right. Well, obviously, I want to make sure that she is okay. And do you, can I, I'm going to try to get a hold of my, um, I have a cousin that lives there. That I, is she in being arrested or are you just trying to find this guy? So right now, it's still like an ongoing investigation. So I don't really have that answer for you right now. We got to figure out everything that's going on, which is why she's detained. Yeah, we don't have a driver's license for him, but hold on. He's from Florida. Hold on. Okay, so. Ma'am? Yeah, he's from Florida. Okay. Do you happen to know his date of birth? Me? No, um, um, yeah, either or, actually. Do you know his date of birth? I don't know like, the exact date of birth. You don't know the exact date of birth? Yes, Caitlin. Guess what do you think it is? Does he have an Instagram account? Facebook? Any um, social media? That's all. Hold on, one question. One question at a time. Just gave like five. It, the social media account. Does he have any? Ms. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't know if he does or not, Caitlin. I think, I mean, I think so. I don't... Caitlin, what's his, yes or no, Caitlin, does he have an Instagram account? I know he does. What is it? Mom, my head is buzzing. I don't give a Caitlin. Answer the question. What's his Instagram account? I don't, I don't even follow him on Instagram anymore. So I don't know what his Instagram account name is. But all I'm, all I'm saying is, is he's from, he's from Florida. Okay. No, his, his name right now. I need someone to go where she is. What's his last name? Mm-hmm. Okay. What's his... Caitlin, do you have a picture of him on your Instagram account? Mom, I can't even get access to my phone. I, well, I have a phone, so answer the question. What are you asking me? Do, do you have a picture, a picture of him picture? on your Instagram? No, I have no picture of him on my Instagram. You're not tagged in any pictures with him? No. Okay, what's his Instagram account, Caitlin? Mom, I don't know. We don't even follow each other. I don't know what his Instagram tag name is. Do you have Instagram? Huh? Do you have Instagram? No. Mom, you can. Mom, you follow me on Instagram. You can see that, like, you can see who I follow. But I'm asking if he has a picture. What's his Instagram account? What's his last name, Caitlin? Raphael what? I just said it. Okay. Sarah, where is this? At? Where are you guys at? Where did this happen? You were just at the. This is in Georgia. Oh, I'm sorry. Where is it? In, this is going to be in Dunwoody, Georgia. In Dunwoody? Yes. Okay. Uh, um. Okay. Let me see if 
I can look him up. Hold on a second. Okay. If you can find anything, uh, you can just text is, this phone number exactly, a picture. What exactly are you guys trying to look for? Him. I'm trying to find no, him. No, I know, but... Like, any, any description of him, because right now you've given us very little other than a blackmail. Okay. So, uh, I'm, we, we need something more to go off of. If I give you guys his name, can you there's, there could be hundreds of people with that. That's the thing. Without a date of birth, we can't be sure. You know? Yes. All right. Uh, I'm gonna hang up the phone um, just so I can get kind of get further along with this. Okay, let me um, work on that for sure. I get a picture for you. All right, thank you. Okay. All right. Bye. All right. Bye. Bye. She wasn't wearing her seatbelt. Hit her head uh, uh, on the windshield. windshield. Was the windshield like cracked? Yeah, it's cracked on the passenger side. She wasn't wearing a seatbelt. She crawled out of the passenger side, um, and then she was helped over here by the cab officer that's working uh, up at Crown Plaza. So. She's a little uneasy on her feet. She's had uh, talked to her mom. She's had a couple of concussions before. Um, so. But yeah, neither seat belt's locked. Passenger side when uh, windshield has a big old crack in front. Yeah, from where probably a forehead. Luckily, the woman only sustained minor injuries and was able to receive treatment at the local hospital before being discharged later that night. However, upon inspecting the deserted car, authorities found the woman's phone inside and discovered her boyfriend's passport in the trunk. Jackpot. Yeah, see you can find that chick's phone. Yeah, there's, I know. There's one phone in the floorboard of the, of the driver's side. One phone? Yeah. That's probably hers because he's got his. He shut it off after one phone call. Uh, it's uh, reeking pretty strong of uh, marijuana in the car as well. Yeah, that looks like hers. All right. Hey. Huh? Found a passport. Found a passport? Yeah. That picture's him. Done for going through it, yeah. Although they couldn't locate the boyfriend that night, a few days later, he perhaps understood he was a fugitive and decided to surrender at the Dunwoody Police Department, potentially avoiding further complications. So you need to get your stuff out of the car and all that? Yes. Um, you'll be able to get that I am on the stop, so... Um, this is Officer Hanson, so he'll take care of all you need to do. So, when are you going to get stuff out of the car? You can go get it out of the impound tomorrow. Uh -huh. so, yeah. Up. Uh, you have your ID and stuff with you? Uh, no, I do not. So, you got any questions right now? No, sir. All right. I'm sure you've already been relayed everything about kind of bond amount, stuff like that. Yes, sir. All right. Because I remember reading that uh, you're trying to get your phone out. Yeah. All right, go ahead, step in. As a result of his bad decisions, 
this idiot was confronted with numerous charges, such as hit and run, reckless driving, operating an unregistered vehicle without a valid license, which clarifies why this big dummy had his passport in the trunk, speeding on roadways designed for traffic, disobeying traffic control devices, not wearing a seatbelt, possessing less than an ounce of the sweet stuff that they could smell in his car, disorderly conduct, and attempting to flee or elude the police. He is now being taken to the DeKalb County Jail. We're gonna stand behind this officer and the gentleman right here. You came, I'll be honest, it came very close to a felony hit and run. Alright? Her injuries were not severe enough to fall under that, but they were getting close. Okay? So, I'll, I'm gonna be honest, it, it came very close. Um, so, we kept it all in city, none of it state charges, um, it'll be a court date, that's why you have, the bond has to be paid at Dunwood. Um, at Dunwood? Yeah, at the city of Dunwood. So, like, where you were? Yeah. That's where they gotta go to pay it. Or you can go through a bonding company. Bonding company will take care of it. You just gotta pay the bonding company however much they exactly. Okay, then yeah. So, pretty much once we're here, once we get through the doors, I'd get the handcuffs off, yeah. Um, as soon as they tell me I can. Uh, once you're processed into the system, put in pictures, taking all that fun stuff, uh, I'll head back to PD, sign my end of the paperwork so that you can get out as quick as you can. I don't know about how long their process is on this end, but I'm gonna make sure mine is as smooth as possible, okay? Stay, stay in the car. Picture this, it's October 17th, 2021, around 2 p.m. in Ocala, Florida. An officer spots a four-door gray sedan trying to pull off the most epic fail of a right turn at Main Street and Fifth Avenue by swerving straight into the left lane. As if things couldn't get any more ridiculous, the driver realizes they're about to get busted and decides to channel their inner Forrest Gump, bolting from the car. Our officer, not one to miss out on some cardio, calls for backup and takes off running after the wannabe track star. Let's see how this stupid decision worked out for this dumb Karen. Northwest Old Bush, Ten Road, Flora Tag, Delta, Quebec, Yankee, Whiskey 38, DQYNW38, it's gonna be on a, a Chrysler. Stay in the car. Stay, stay in the car. Stay in the car. Stay. No, please. Stay. Please. No, please. Okay, stay. This stay. I'm on take us, please, sir. Can you get my 
my phone out the car, please. I need it, please. I need it. I ain't got no family, please. I need it. Please. I ain't got no family, please. I'm begging you. Can you get my phone out, please? Can you get my phone out, please? Miss, can you please? Can you please? Can you come over here one minute? I know y'all, y'all just don't know me. Can you fix her clothing for me, please? Can you please get my phone out? Do me a favor. Stand back. All right, do me a favor. Stand back. If you, if, well, she's resisting me. I told her many times, stop. It's fine. You can sit there and do whatever you want to. Man, I'm trying to come over here and talk to y'all. Can y'all please go, go talk to me, bro? Listen, I'm trying to tell y'all my name. Go inside the car. You too aggressive with me. Can I please get this other man? Ma'am, Ma just take a seat in the car. Please, get in the car. Can I please call my people? You can call, you can call your people. I'm trying to listen, Miss, Miss McKiskey, can I talk to you? I'm Sergeant no, Marie's cousin. Oh, I'm fucking bro. Okay, I'm ready and clear it. Go sit in the car. I'm trying to talk to her. She wants to search me. Please, you're too aggressive with me. I appreciate it. Mommy, please. We're going to be at uh, 817 Northwest 23rd Avenue. Is this your house? I, um, oh, I, thought, I didn't know this was the car. I thought one of those was the car. I, I gave him. I gave him the address. Yeah, we can do um, a tow. Okay. Can tow it. I'm giving them the car to them. To whom? My cousin. That's what I'm trying to haul it. That's what you're trying to haul it? Yeah, literally. That's what I'm saying. Can I please get out? Do you own it? Yeah. No, that's what I'm saying. That's so my you, case. I'm trying to get out. Want to put out so the car's not registered to anyone here. I'm trying to give it to the owner. Literally. Who's, the Who's the owner? Because the I'm owner's not. Hide. That's his dad. Monte's dad. Can I please get out first? Which one is? No, you can't get out, but you can tell me which one's Monte's dad. The so it's owned by Monte? Is it owned by Monte? No, I haven't even. It's the owner. Gainesville. At Gainesville. We're, yeah. we're, we're towing it. Okay. Can I get a copy? 114 Bravo. Can you go ahead and start his rotation? We didn't start him. Give us a second. No, the car I'm trying to tell you, literally, Mama, okay. can you please it's open the, the door? Door. So I can't open the door. I can't. I'm not trying to lose my job today. That's not even my car. Who, whoever it belongs to is the only person that's out of Gainesville. That's what I'm saying. I'm trying to tell you. Look. Can I get my phone, please? I can make a call. Is it in the car? Yes. Yes, I will give you I'm your phone. Tell you, so listen, I have a warrant for my arrest already. What? Where was she going? Where was she going? Yeah. She was not. She made a first. She made a blinker. She put her blinker on yeah. when I got behind her, yeah. trying to go straight. Then after I got behind her, we even have plain smell. So yeah. when I got behind her, she turned into here, and then she ran into that guy's house over there, and he told her, "Hey, he he, he can't come. He don't live here. He can't come here." Yeah. She's got a little bit of weed. How you doing today, sir? I'm sorry you guys had to see that. I'm, I tried to tell her many times, stop, stop. She tried to run to that. Was that you, was that, you that was on the front door? No, yeah, I was coming out. That, that was you, right? Yeah. Yeah, she tried to run to this house. I saw that. I saw her. Do you mind if I talk to you? What? Just asking you quick. Did you know her? No, sir. She, you don't know? You have no idea who she is? No, she know my son, though. I ain't going to lie. I ain't trying to get in That's no fine. trouble or nothing, bro. No, no, I just want to make sure. I don't, I don't know. But you saw what happened. I was coming out of my house, bro. And somebody was running there, so I don't know what's going on. I don't even know her name, bro. I understand you did the right thing. Yeah, yeah. I got the hell out of the way. Shit. Uh -huh. Shit, I don't even know her. 
Alright. Do you mind if I get your name translated if you try to ride no. in your house? You don't want that? Nope. Nobody. Uh, she going to go nowhere in my yard. You saw where she went, bro. No, I'm just saying that. Do you mind if I get your name so I can document it on my I report? I don't want my name you on don't want it? bro. I don't All even right. want to be talking about it because I don't okay. know her or what's going on. Be All honest right. with you. That's fine, sir. My That's name fine. getting sh something come up. I got to be on. I ain't got nothing to do with nothing, bro. I'm All just right. being totally well, honest with you. I appreciate it. You I saw what happened, so I don't I, know her. I know. Period. She can't even tell you my name. If I knew her, I'll try to see what was going on, but bro, man, that Meet somebody soon. I come out, dude. Bro, you don't even know, bro. Right, thank you. Yes, sir. Nobody knows her over there. Where's your ID at? I got her name. I got her name. You got her name? Thank you. Single zero. I'm ready to go. Yeah, single zero in there. I know. I just told her I had to work my Covert off. I'm, gonna, I'm waiting for them to get the signal zero thingy done. I told you I'm honest. Like, I had a warrant for my arrest already. I'm trying to get across to Jamonte Flower. First thing is important, right? Are you okay? Not really. Do you need medical? Do you want me to get you EMS or he check you out? Are you sure? Yes, sir. Okay. Is it too hot in there for you? Let me put the AC on. Can you please just open up the door so I can get, I got a sound. I'm not, after what happened here, I'm not going to open the door. I'm sorry. But you slammed me, sir. You ran. I, I did I not tell did. you many times. I'm not going to argue with you, all right? It's on my body camera. I told you many times to stop, stop, stop. And you keep resisting me. So stop. I mean, we're not going to keep going back and forth on that. Hey, did you take a picture of it? Where was that? Where was it at? Where was it at? Okay, just put it back in there the way it was and take a picture of it. So, another what? mess. I'm sorry. Yeah, another mess. I don't. I don't care. <laughs> Are you? Hold on a second. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm. Fine. I'm I was trying to. Yeah. What is what's that on your vest? Is that food or is that blood? I think it's food. Okay, I'm okay with that. So, she was going down, um, she was coming out of 20th Ave, made him proper right turn, got behind her, put her blinkers trying to go the opposite way, uh, trying to get away from me, but then she decided, oh, that's not a good idea, let me just turn into here, into Blishton. So she made a left turn, and when I got lit her up over here, she's kind of sped up into here, stopped, got out of the vehicle, and tried to run into that guy's house who did not want to give me his name and um, he told her no 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 you're not coming to my house so I grabbed her over there held on to her and kind of brought her over here she was resisting the whole time I was telling her stop 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 we got over here she still wants to continue resisting me trying to kind of get into the car mm -hmm. so at that point I grabbed her and took her, to the ground. took her to the ground nothing crazy just you know I kind of so which is the guy put her out, 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 the, out. the guy with the hat oh, okay yeah. oh, I mean if he doesn't want to Give you information then. Yeah, there's nothing we can do about it. But, um, Are you injured? No, I'm good. So, explain to me direction again. <laughs> did, you, did you chase her? Like car chase? No, no, or no. Or were no. you just following her? No, I was following her. Okay. But when I got behind her, it, she just took a, a quick turn. So I was call, I thought she was going to go straight. You're talking about on Blitzen? Oh, from the beginning, right? Yeah. From the beginning, she was going uh, westbound on Blitzen. She came out of 20th... Uh, oh, Blitzen Road or Blitzen Road? No, no, no. I, I know Blitzen it's a little Road. confusing. Yeah, okay, Blitzen, Blitzen Road. Road. Yeah. Okay. So she was coming out of 20th Ave, going westbound. Okay. And then she made an improper uh, right, right turn. turn. Got behind her. Didn't know which way she wanted to go. And then she decided, oh, I'm going to go this way. And then turned on to uh, Old Blitzen, Old Blitzen Road. Road. And then came down here. And then came down here. I lit her up and then she just... Okay, when... Uh, did you handcuff her after you brought her to the ground? Yeah, after I brought uh, I brought her to the ground, and then 
uh, yeah, I think after uh, after I uh, brought her on the ground. All right. So she tried to run in the eight seventeen. Yeah, eight seventeen. And then you just like grabbed her and forcefully pulled her away because she was trying to pull away. She was from trying you. to get into the and house. Then, yeah. yeah. Was the door open or closed? Uh. Do you remember? I remember. Okay. okay. And then, but she was trying to get in back into the car as yeah. you guys were coming. So this we way. came here. I tried to put her against the hood. And then she kept resisting me towards the door. Okay. So over here, I told her to stop, stop, and then she kept resisting me, trying to say, I'm gonna, I need to call somebody, blah, 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 you know what I mean? And at that point, I held on to her and put her on the ground. Okay. I told her many times and to stop, to stop, Sole to stop. occupant, or just her? Yeah, it's just her. And you had a 32, a, z a zero in there? Yeah, it was a single zero in there. Uh, I think you just got it. Okay. And, uh, and where's you got single 30 more. agency or at a... Uh, no, Orango ran it. Orango. Oh. Where, where's the 32 out of? Out of our agency. Our, our agency. What is it? I'm gonna you don't fix our cups for her real quick. What is it? I'm gonna fix her cups. Okay. Tamika Lewis. So that's what we got. Okay. What are you waiting for? Right now? Yeah. Nothing. I was just dealing with you came and then. Yeah. I was just gonna do like a thorough search of the vehicle. I don't know what you want me to do. Let me just take her and go. Okay. Yes, Arango can take care of everything As soon else. as the 48 is confirmed, okay. if it is or isn't. Um, uh oh, they know. What? Because. I'm trying to swipe the dirt off my face. Oh, I, I got you. I thought you were trying to get the weed off. Uh, You're aggressive, man. I told you to stop many times. All you have to do is stop. All you have to do is stop. I told you this is the time I knocked on the door with a little bit of Monte or whatever the case may be. I'm 150, baby. I told her I had a one and out there. I'm honest. I'm sorry to read because I'm definitely honest. Like, you ain't got the, I'm no threat. I ain't, you ain't got to do none of that to me. Karen got herself a little task list from the misdemeanor probation office, courtesy of the Salvation Army Correctional Services. She's now the proud owner of 20 hours of community service with the County Solid Waste Department. That just sounds gross. Anyways, as a cherry on top, she gets six months of probation to figure out how to become the department's newest trash-talking volunteer extraordinaire. Home. I was going to call when I got home. I wanted to get home and I was going to call when I got home. So let me ask you, why is it that, why is it that you were hitting all these uh, I know you haven't the first you stop yet. Picture this, it's October 31st, 2022, and the Massachusetts State Police and Salem Police are setting the stage for a Halloween tale to remember. An elderly woman, channeling her inner demolition derby driver, managed to collide with several parked cars before being pulled over. When an officer inquired about the chaos, she nonchalantly remarked that she planned to call it in once she got home. Classic, but I'm not going to call her a Karen out of respect for my elders. Nonetheless, the next question was a no-brainer. Have you been drinking? Her answer? A gem for the ages. Of course I've been drinking just not enough to cause all this mess. Although, clearly, she did. And so begins our saga. While the Massachusetts State Police were first responders, things really get interesting when the Salem Police join the party, as you are about to see. Alright, what's going on here? I don't know. You don't know? You know, you, I know. I did. I did. I know. I do know. Okay. So why? Why? Why haven't you? Why didn't you stop? I was going to stop when I got home. I was going to call when I got home. I wanted to get home, and I was going to call when I got home. So let me ask you, why is it that Why is it that you were hitting all these? Uh, I know you haven't hit the first stop yet. I have a second one, same spot. What happened? 
but I wanted, I, not enough to do this, and I, I wanted to get home, and I was going to call when I got home. I did want to call when I got home. Okay, well, that is what you not going to help you now. Okay, what's going to help me? All right, so, so we're on web at Essex. Web. Yeah, I have some units coming, thank you. What do you right. want me to do? All right, so right now, why don't you give me a license? Okay. Where do you live? Oh, you live on Freeman Road. Okay. Can I call my daughter? Uh, no. Oh, I can't because my phone died. I'm All right. So, what, I mean. What's going to happen? Well, so let me ask you. I mean, so you said that you've been drinking, but like. <laughs> I had one drink. I had. All right, two drinks. I had two drinks. Okay. Cause and then I'm not drunk. Because you don't seem intoxicated to me. So I'm, so I'm still asking, like, how is it that you, like, hit all those cars? I know. I don't know. You don't know? Okay. All right. I'm sorry. I don't know. I wanted to make it home, and I was going to call when I got home. Okay. All right. Um, just stay right there for a minute. husband I know it's not an excuse I know it is not an excuse yeah and he loved Halloween and I wanted to just come down here to do this for him um, I'm very sorry for what I've done I'm very very sorry and um, I, I haven't I don't know I haven't even gotten that far I'm gonna it's my time I know I know you know I know I don't know. You guys go to uh, Union Street and let me know how many vehicles we're uh, hit. Alright, Roger. We're, uh, we're right behind you. We're going to head that way now. Hi, Roger. We're, uh, we're right behind you. We're going to head that way now. Just, yeah, just look at Union. Oh, yeah. Oh, totally. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Go ahead. My husband's going to be very upset. Vehicle started. Uh, he's going to be stuck around the area of 85 Essex Street, possibly more on Hawthorne Boulevard as well. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
So we're going to do some field sobriety tests. So I'm going to ask you, do you want to take off your shoes? You know, it's going to be some walking and some and some standing still. No, you don't have to. I'm asking you if, if, if you want to take them off. No? Okay. All right. So um, do you want to take the veil thing off or anything? Or are you comfortable the way you are? I guess maybe. It, this is all up to you. about the whole thing, so. I know. I mean, this is all up to you what you want to take off, okay? All right. All right. Are we comfortable like that? All right. So I'm going to do a few what we call field sobriety tests, okay? I'm going to read the directions to you, okay? I'm going to demonstrate it, and then you will do it, okay? Okay. Um, you obviously understand English. Um, you, do you have any injuries on you? No. Okay. All right. So the, the first... Um, the first one we're going to do is called a walk and turn, okay? So, um, walking and turning, you're going to walk forward nine steps. He, I'm going to move out of the way for he's you. Gonna, he's going to move, yeah. yeah. Um, so, you're going to walk forward nine steps, heel to toe, counting out loud as you go. When you get to the ninth one, you're going to turn around and do the same thing back. Heel to toe, um, counting as you go. So, so don't stop. Right. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to demonstrate it for you, all right? So, you get just hands by your side, right? And you're going to do heel to toe and count out loud. So, one... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. When you get to the end, turn around, do the same thing back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay? Do you have any questions? And you understand that? So forward nine and backward nine. Yep, so when you're ready. So, yeah, so it's going to, yeah, he'll show. There you go. So remember, you're going to count out loud, right? Heel to toe and count out loud as you go. Okay? It looks white, but, um, Three, it looks four, like it's been because it's got six, some rough. Seven, eight, nine. Okay. All right. Um, okay, so the next we're going to do um, is what we call a one-legged stand, okay? And you can choose either leg. It's either going to be your left leg or your right leg, whichever one you're comfortable with, okay? You're going to keep your hands down at your side. And you're going to lift your leg, and you're going to count 
uh, until I tell you to stop. I don't even know if I could do that sober. Okay. I'm sorry. Do you, do you want to try to do it or no? no. Okay. All right. Um, and then lastly, if you just want to, um, do you know the alphabet? Um, if you just want to say the alphabet for me, don't sing it. Just, just say the alphabet for me. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, F, T, U, D, W, X, Y, Z. Okay. Okay. I'm going to do HGN. Okay. So, ma'am, do me a favor. So, um, do you wear glasses? Do you wear glasses or anything? Nighttime. You wear nighttime glasses. Yes. Okay. So, do me a favor. Just keep your hands by your side and your feet together, okay? I want you to focus on this. Just focus on the pen, okay? Don't move your head. Just use your eyes to, to move, okay? Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Just focus on the pen, okay? Uh, can you just confirm? I, I, I think some uh, other officers might have called a few places in to on Area Y4. We just want to make sure we got all of them. If you can just print just one out. One more time, okay? Just again, in. keep your head still and just focus on the pen, okay? Roger. She so doesn't jerk me Yeah. Okay. Um, here, you can take this. You can take this back. Yes. Definitely. All right. So, um, this is what's going to happen right now. So, um, you are going to be under arrest for operating while under the influence of alcohol, okay? Um, we are going to tow your car because it is not drivable. Right. Okay. To BP. Um, I'm going to have to so I, I have a plate. Well, that, that's not uh, what, what? that's not how it works. Uh, we're we're, we're going to call a tow company, and they're just they're going to take it. Uh, probably bill, bills, which is on Commercial Street. They can't bring it to BP station. No, 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 They don't do anything special uh, for that. Okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, you need to put your hands behind your back, please. Here we go. Can you uh, bring me gonna, my pocketbook? Yep, we're, 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 we're going to bring your pocketbook. I need to yep, we'll bring your pocketbook. Yep, oh, my daughter. Yep, we're, we're going to call your daughter when we get there. Yep, yep, we're going to grab the stuff for you, okay? We're going to go right over here. Uh, so. Have a seat right in there. I'll go grab the first. I don't know. Can you help me get in? Yeah. I'm sorry. Thank no, you. nope. This no. is this is not this is a tough bag here. No liquor in the car. No, 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 nothing like that. Yep. Oh, why do I keep doing that? That's the second time you've done it. Yeah, I know. 
I know. I'm, I'm sure I'll, I'm sure there'll be a third. Um, here, you want to just throw this stuff over this, dude? Sure. All right, so we called for a tow, right? I got a tow coming. Yep. All right. Um, I have a... Oh my god, I will call you when I'm ready. Yeah, we'll <laughs> that sounds like a lot right now. You can't say you can't open it up in court, but at least it can be in a report. Yeah. She was unsteady on her feet. Um, yeah. She's drinking gin. She said she was drinking gin. Yeah. She said she was drinking gin. She told me she had two drinks. She was enough. She's like, wait. Yeah. Um, did you, uh, did you smell anything on her breath? I did not. Okay. But you know what, when you're in the book alone, that may change. Yeah, no, no, exactly. I was just wondering what, what uh... All right, if, Mike, if you want to just put that back for me. All right, I'm taking her. Thank you for your help. All right. Nice shot. I heard her on foot. They're like, she's getting away from us. They were chasing her on foot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 One, of the, one of the troopers said... We're here. getting, like, information. She heard this screech as she was really on the gas. It's, well, it's that tire. But the tire was making a wreck. So, um, so I was on Blaney Street, so I knew she was going to be coming past me. And so I, I just figured waited. she either had to come this way. And all of a sudden I see all this smoke coming. And I was like, oh, my God. And I took a gamble. Oof. Alright. Uh, I can make a coffee. Yeah, why would you do that? I don't mind at all. I'm here to help you guys, so you can hate it with that. Do you mind if I take down your name? No, not at all. Mike Cashman. Cashman. C A S H M A N. 2962. 2962. Okay. Uh, that's a big number. Just, um, just let's make sure, um, we're getting the story sheet. Yeah. Do you do you want to shoot? I have one. Well, uh, oh, I'll do it if you want to. I, I don't want to leave her in here for too long. Yeah. Okay. All right, Shannon, we're off. I didn't mean to leave you for so long. Yep. Can I ask you? I have my house key is in the cup in my car. Can you? Oh. Yep. It's a house key cup in the first cup. Okay. But it's not in there, so I guess she's just out of luck for now. Alright. All right. Okay. Yeah, if you guys can just look, it's just a white, it's a single key. A single key for a house. So no, so it wasn't in the cup holders or on the seat. So they're gonna they're gonna go through the car and see if they can find it. It was it, I'm telling you I I looked. The only thing that was there with us was like a rosary. And, uh. Will I be able to charge the phone? Do you know her number? No, offhand? I don't. Okay. Isn't it crazy when you don't have your cell phone? You don't know people's numbers? Yes. Okay. I, 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 I'm, I'm I don't know anybody's number. I'm with you. Charger with me, so okay. Oh, yeah, that's fine. We can okay. charge it. I have yeah. my charger with me. So okay. Maybe you can charge it and I can call her. 21's control. I'm going to be coming in with uh, one under arrest. Um, and 26 and 30 is standing by for the tow. 
we have that. Office of if you want to start one in the yep. I believe he is 41 times. Roger. Can I talk to her and let her know what's going on? I don't know if it will pick up though. Hi, Jessica. 27. So. Hi. Um, so, um, this is Officer O'Leary with the Seattle Police Department. 43 bar for Um. So your mom's your mom's uh, under arrest for um, operating under the influence of alcohol. Um, so your mom, your mom. Um, I have her in the in the rear. Rare records. Yes, Roger. she is okay. So what happened is um, she hit a few parked cars. Uh, no. And um, so I'm not even to the station yet. It's it's the the booking process is probably going to be about an hour. Okay. Um, Salem uh, Salem Police Station. We're at 95 Margin Street. Control 21. Oh, oh, hold on one second. 21. We have an issue with our BT machine. I just called over to Marblehead. They're willing to accommodate if you want to meet there first and then uh, bring her in for booking. Okay. Sorry about that. Um, okay, so... Um, oh, so she hit a few cars uh, on Essex Street and then... Uh, she was coming down Union Street and hit a few cars on Union Street. I'm not sure how many. Um, no, no, nobody's hurt. She's fine. Unfortunately, Halloween night of 2022 wasn't demolition derby night on the streets of Salem, Massachusetts. Otherwise, no one may have even noticed that this sweet lady hit a bunch of pot costs. However, on the way to the station, she made it clear that she had no interest in providing a breath sample, so they took her straight to the Salem Police Station for processing, and her daughter picked her up. Lastly, I don't think that there's anything that a BP mechanic can do to fix her demolished vehicle, so it's a good thing that they didn't tow it there. I know my rights. I know my rights as a citizen. So what do you guys want to Go and open your window. This one. Okay. Yes, sir. So I'm Officer Gonzalez with State. Sorry. Officer Gonzalez with State Police. Okay. Back to Las Cruces. Okay. So we got reports that you were driving the wrong way. Okay. Were you going the wrong way? And I. No, no, no. no. I was not. Definitely not. I just barely turned around right now. I'm okay. You. you have a driver's license? Yes, sir. I do. Do you have your insurance registration uh, on you? My insurance is online, mm -hmm. um, and I have not. I just lost my phone. I just okay. Lost my iPhone, so I was not able mm -hmm. to get my, uh, my insurance on there. But I do have insurance. I promise. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I do have my registration. Well, let, okay. Uh, let me put that up here. Twenty twenty four. There you go. And then I have my insurance right here. Okay. Or my license. Sorry about that. So where are you coming from? I'm coming from El Paso. El Paso? I just got a little lost. I turned around barely right now. Just right now, I'm telling you. Where are you headed to? To Las Cruces. Mexico. Las Cruces? Is, okay. You know that way? Yeah. Yes, sir. Okay. You have insurance for the vehicle? The insurance? I'm telling you. No. On my, it's on my phone. It's online. And I just okay. lost my phone yesterday. All right. Well, do me a favor. Uh, turn your vehicle off. Let me see the keys. Is this your vehicle? Yes, sir. Of course okay. it is. And go ahead and step to the back for me, okay? Okay. Thank you, ma'am.
over here. You okay? Yes, sir. Okay. So, all right. So here's what I can see. Okay. Okay. Uh, I sm I smell alcohol on you. No, I have not okay. drank alcohol today. No. Oh, so what? I drank maybe earlier at like two o'clock, but that I mean it's it's nine. Right now. Time for man. So, thank you. I mean, I drank some water. I went home. Okay. So so what? Okay, hold on. So you say you drank at two p.m. Yes, sir. Two p.m. What did you drink? I drank um just a little twisted tea. Yes, sir. Twisted tea? A twisted tea, yes. Is that like the tall can or? No, it was a little short one. Like the 12 ounce? Yes, sir. 12, okay. It was the shortest one. The, short, the cheapest one that they can get. Mop was 12, man. That was at 2 p.m. whenever I got off of work. Okay, well, I can smell alcohol on you, okay? Okay, um, yes, sir. And I have not been. Okay, to you. all right. Uh, so I'm going to have you do a couple of tests, make sure you're okay to drive, okay? Yes, sir. Um, of course. My biggest concern is that we got a call that you were driving the wrong way, the wrong that you way. were going south in the northbound lane. Okay, okay. Uh, were you were you driving the wrong way? No, Did you sir, get lost? I was driving that way, and I barely turn around right now, just so I can go back okay. home to Las Cruces. Okay. Yes, All right. Sir. Just give me a second. Okay. Don't go anywhere. Okay. Yes, so, we're, so you're headed to Cruces? I was going towards Cruces. Yes, sir. Okay. For what? And to go home. You live in cruises? Yes, sir. I do live in cruises. I came here to drive just to, just for a cruise. Okay. And then I got lost, and I was not driving the opposite way. I meant to turn on right now. The okay. Time. And you're coming. What were you doing in El Paso? I was just driving, taking a cruise. You went to I El Paso? I just got off of work at 2 p.m. So Where do you work? At me. Okay, here and in cruises? I went home for two hours, mm -hmm. took a drink there for okay. about two, three hours or so. Two and a half. So you drank at home? Yes, I drank at home, sir. Okay. All right. Give me a second, okay? Just stay right here for me. Problem? I'm going to have you do a couple of tests, okay? okay? There is a problem because we got calls that you were going the wrong way. But I wasn't okay? going the wrong way. So hold on. Okay. I yes, can sir. smell alcohol on you. But I have SFS drink. designed to let me know if it's or not. Okay. Uh, do that. Uh, if I don't see clues, lose, you go on your way, okay? Just stay here, okay? But don't come back in your... Just real quick. No. Just, I don't know if you have any weapons, okay? So I'll just... I don't have any weapons. You okay. can check my car and everything. Okay. Well... I promise you, you can check my car. Okay. There's nothing in there. I just... You got on the phone with my mom. What happened to your um, hand and your... This I saw you have injuries. This, what happened to this it? This has been the past... This it? has been the past few... Mm -hmm. I think almost a week already. Okay, okay. I went to jail already. And For what? It was what? over... It was breaking and entering with me. Okay. Yes, sir. All right. And I, it was a misunderstanding. You didn't even check it. Mm -hmm. That's what they left the next day on me. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Okay. I mean, I, I'm a good. I have fucking. I have a job. How old are you? I'm 21 years old. 21. I can't even give you my ID, sir. Okay. Well, you you gave me your ID, home. right? The yes, one you sir, gave me? Okay. Yes, sir, I did. I just right. wanted that. I gave it to you. That's okay. All. Yeah, cool. Okay. I'm sure you only drank one uh, twisted tea? I drank one twisted tea. I mean, earlier, Did you drink anything else? I mean, at like 1 o'clock, I think I took a shot. One you, shot. You took a shot of what? One shot of Jim Beam. Jim Beam? Yes. At 1 p.m. and then at 2? And then at 2 I've been driving. I mean, okay. I came sober. I drank water at. I've oh. been doing everything I need to do when I was driving on the outside road. I've been driving. I mean, okay. I came sober, I drank water, I've been oh. doing everything I need to do when I'm driving on the Alpaca Road. Oh, okay. To go home. So I'm being sober and ten haired. How do you feel? I'm fine. I you can walk in a straight line okay. and everything. Look, you know. Okay. Well, just just stay right. Well, hold on, hold on. I know. I mean, so just stay here. Let me uh my unit a little bit, okay? Okay, cool. All right. Go ahead, sir. Wear contacts? I mean, no. Wear it sometimes. That's all. Okay. Well, have... scrap for a yes, Oh. Sure, I do. Are you to have when yes, you're driving? Sir. And saw the eye doctor. So are you wearing? It's in process. Are right you now, wearing no. contacts right now? Right now. No. No. Okay. Sir. So just don't put your hands in your pockets, okay? Okay. In my pockets, right. yes, sir. Don't don't put your hands in your pockets. Okay. Thank you. No problem. Okay. All right. Can you see my finger? Mm -hmm. You can. Yes, sir. Okay. So what I want you to do? Follow my finger with your eyes and eyes only, okay? okay. You have any questions? No. Nope. Do you understand the test? Yes, sir. Okay. All right, come up here. Yes, Can I have you stand here? Okay. Can you imagine a straight line in front of you from here? Mm -hmm. From here, right here. Can, can you stand over here? Yeah. Thank you, bro. No, right, no, I, I was asking him. Sorry, right. So, So can you face your car? Okay. Okay, so, so what I, 
So what I want you to do, go to the, well, first of all, you have any problems walking, balancing, turning? I mean, I do I do have a cut in my leg right now. I have stitches, just mm -hmm. like you, you noticed. Mm -hmm. I do have this, and it makes me limp. What's that? It's it's a cut. I do have a, a they should have stitched me, but they didn't. Mm -hmm. and so you have a cut? a big cut right here. I have mm -hmm. one, yeah. stitches? and I have two. Yes, sir. Two and stitches? They, they put the butterfly, okay. the butterfly mm -hmm. thing. When did that happen? That was on Saturday. This past Saturday? This past Saturday. Yes, sir. Okay. All right, ma'am. So can you imagine a straight line in front of you? Oh, okay. Yes, sir. Okay. So what I want what I want you to do, place your right foot in front of your left. Okay. Don't start the test, okay? Okay. Don't I start the test. Because my knee hurts. That's okay. So so don't hurts. start the test, okay? Ow. Hold on. Hold on. I'm sorry. Okay. So I'm gonna explain what you have to do. Okay, so just listen. Don't 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 start the test. Just listen to what I'm telling you. Okay. Okay. So place your right foot in front of your left, just like this. Okay. Keep your hands on your side. Okay. Just like this, the way I'm doing it. Okay. Okay. You're gonna stay in that position. I'm gonna explain the test to you. Okay. You're gonna take nine huddle toe steps going forward on that imaginary line. It's gonna okay. look like this. Okay. One. Okay. Two. Three, I took three to show you. You're gonna take nine steps, okay? Right. On your ninth step, your front foot, leave it planted. Back foot, take small steps to turn around. Once you have turned around, you're gonna take nine more heel to toe steps coming back on that imaginary line, okay? okay. It's gonna look like this. One, two, three. Okay. I took three to show you. You're gonna take how many steps? I'm gonna take nine and then nine back. Yes, ma'am. Yes, okay. Sir. Do you have Total. Do you have any questions? No, I don't. You don't? Okay. No, I don't. But so my you... knee hurts. That's the only thing that I'm worried about here. Is okay. I want you to take me to jail on my knees. Okay. Actually split open. Okay. When you're ready. As well as my arms. So okay. When you're ready. When you're ready, you can start. Okay? okay. Keep your hands on your side. Okay. Hold on. Did okay. the test? You can't stop until you have completed the test. Okay. Even if my knee is. Hold on. Listen to me. Okay. Yes. Okay. Sir. Uh, once you have started the test, you can't stop until you have completed the test. Okay. Make sure you're looking down on your toes. But make sure you keep your hands on your side and make sure you count out loud each step, okay? I understand that, sir. But do you understand that my knee is split open? I understand. So if, My knee is split open. Okay. So if I do mess up this whole thing right here, it's mm. not my issue because my okay. knee is split open. It is okay. split open, and, and I have no, I don't, I don't need to lie to you, sir. Okay. My, my knee is split open, for real, and so is my arm. Okay. And, and can all it's... Do you want to give it a try? Okay. Okay, go, go, when you're ready, you can start, okay? Yes, ma'am. Alright, cool. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Go ahead and stand right here. Stand right here and face me again. Oh. No, no, no. It, it, it. Okay. Okay, go ahead and face me. Right, okay, thank you. I'm sorry. I, want you to put, I want you to put your feet together like this and your hands on your side, okay? You're gonna lift the leg of your choice approximately six inches above the ground, okay? Yes, sir. It's gonna look like this, okay? You're gonna keep your hands on your side, uh, toes pointing forward, knee, keep your knees straight. Yes, You're gonna count out loud 1001, 1002, 1003. All the way to 1000. I'll tell you when to stop, okay? okay. You can use the leg of your choice, okay? Okay, um, no. Do you understand the test? I think so. When you're ready, ma'am, I'll tell you when to start, okay? Bring this one up. Yes, sir. One. Go, go two, ahead and start. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Make sure you look nine, down on your toes. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. Okay, stop. You know how to count? Yes, sir. I'm okay. Did you go to school? Yes, sir, I did. Which school did you go to? Las Cruces High School. Las Cruces High School? College. You're in college? Yes, sir, I am. Okay. For psychology. Okay. Uh, 
Go ahead and count back from 43 to 22. 43 to 22, yes, Yes, ma'am. On one leg? Or you just want me to come back? Just want you to come back. Okay, That's 43, it. 43, 42, 41, 40, 39, 38, 37, 36, 35, 34, 33, 32, 31, uh, 30, 29, 28, 27, 26, mm -hmm. 25, 24, 23, 22. Okay. Go ahead and put your hand in front of you. My hand in front of me. Just like this, go ahead and face me. In front of me. Just like this, go ahead and face me. Facing you. So what I want you to do, you're gonna touch the tip of your finger with your your thumb with the tip of your finger like this. Okay, so look at me. It's one, two, three, four. Okay. Then you're gonna count back. Four, three, two, one. Okay. That's one set, okay? Alrighty. You're gonna do three sets. Okay. Okay. You have any questions? Nope. Do you understand the test? Yes, sir. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one, one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Okay. You're done with the test? Yes, sir. I know I will. You said four you times. You are done? Yes, sir. Okay. You said four times. All right. So go ahead and stand over here. I have another test for you, okay? Okay. Go ahead and face my unit. Face that way for me. Put your hands behind your back real quick. Why am I being arrested? You're under arrest uh, for suspicion of driving under the influence, okay, ma'am? Wow, and why? Okay. Why? Hold on, hold on, hold oh, on. No, no, Just no. face my unit, okay? I have not even... Okay. Been, you haven't even okay. done anything to me. Okay. You have any weapons on you? Well, how would I have hold weapons on, on me, Hold on, hold on. You have any weapons on no, you? No, I need to call any... somebody then. Okay. I have not done anything wrong, sir. Okay, okay. No. So go ahead and take two steps no, back. No, no, no. What have I done wrong? Okay, no. you're... What have I done wrong? You're under How? arrest for driving How? under the influence of alcohol. How? Okay. How? When That's I why even you're being alcohol. detained, arrested, okay? How? When I haven't okay. drank alcohol, sir? Go ahead and spread your feet real quick. How? When I haven't drank alcohol, sir? Ma'am, no. go ahead and spread your feet. As of my rights, as okay. of my rights, what have I done that I haven't, that I've shown that okay. I told you what my knee okay. is like? Okay. Go, go ahead no, and uh, no, 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 stay no, no, facing no, no, my no. unit. Spread no. your feet real quick. Hey. Stop, please. You need to come okay. for my phone. You are under arrest I for under suspicion arrest. of driving under the influence okay? of alcohol. I told you already. Ma'am, please. No, she okay. needs to call my mom. Bro. Okay, well, what well, well, we'll let you. Well, I've been wrong. Listen, well, I'm trying to. You guys have shown me my. Listen, I've shown yeah. you my leg, bro. I have okay. stitches. Stop, stop. Not listen, done anything wrong. listen to Officer no. Gonzalez, okay? What's your please. Please. Okay, so it's hold on. Hold on. Ow, bro. Hold on, look. Listen. I already told you three times. And what? And I told okay. you what? Whenever okay, I'm we not going to argue with you. Do you have any weapons sir? on you? Go and spread your feet. Okay. Why would I have these things on me, bro? Because I haven't done anything wrong. All right. I'm not going to argue with you. No, no, okay. no. No, Ma'am, please, please. No, no, stop. Ma'am, please, Ow! stop. My stitches, bro. I have fucking stitches. Here. Quit Dude. moving away, okay. ma'am, please. Please, my unit. I'm bleeding, bro. Okay. I'm bleeding because you're grabbing me all aggressive. Hold on. Okay, no, ma'am, no, no, no. stop. You Hold guys on. are. Stop touching me. Stop. stop touching me. You guys made me bleed okay, right look, now. Look, look what you're doing to look, me. You're under arrest for what? driving under the influence of How? alcohol, okay? How? When I've given you all you're, your tests, you are making I've things harder. Right. If you keep persisting, you're going to be charged with more. No, with but I've done account, everything okay? right, sir. All right. I haven't done anything right. I told you exactly what's wrong Let's with call my knee. an ambulance so they can check her little cut. No, you fucking okay. cut me, bro. You cut me, bro. Okay, okay. You enough is enough. You cut me. What the hell, Go ahead and put her in the unit. What the hell? Yeah. What the hell? We don't want, ma'am, we don't want you to hurt he yourself, okay? Me. We don't what want you to. Hell? Quit moving away, ma'am. Where, where, where have I shown you? Okay. Where have I shown you that? All right, ma'am. Ma'am, right. ma right. please right. get in the unit. No. Okay. No, you need to give me an answer. Ma'am. Ma'am, no. no. stop. No. Okay. Get in the unit. Let's go. I'm not going to sit down. Ma'am. No. Get up. You guys are hurting me. Ma'am, get up. Wait three in seconds. We're going to no. help you up. We're going to help you up. Seconds. What do you mean? You wanna no, because you have cut me, bro. Okay. You have okay. dead ass fucking cut me. Well, you, okay. ma'am. You have fucking okay. cut me. And for what, bro? I didn't cut you. you no, you already. did. No. You were no, already cut. Bro, you okay. grabbed me by okay. my arm and okay. you fucking split open my stitches. And what okay. did I do last? Okay. What did I do today? Okay. I've so given you go. everything and I told you that I'm going to be up. Get off. 
Oh, let's go. Look, I might be exposed. Ma'am, quit leaning stuff. against that bush, okay? No. Quit no. leaning against the sticker what bush. What am I doing wrong, sir? Well, for, well, for starters, you're leaning yeah, against the sticker no, bush. For starters. What have I done wrong? I also, you're placed under arrest. In, wait, are you gonna let me talk? Why? Are you gonna let me talk? Yes or no? But did you guys listen that my knee is f***ed up since? Are you gonna let me talk? Look at my. Need, are you gonna let me talk? You asked me a question. I'd like to answer your no, question. Listen, are, bro, you, you guys are still gonna arrest me. Well, you're already under arrest. You're Why not, am I under arrest? For driving under the influence of and alcohol or and or drugs. Where is the fucking alcohol? I can smell give it me on my you. Test All right, now. So, so the give way me my works, test. Those way, look, man. No, give look. me my alcoholic yeah. test. That's how it's supposed to work, you know? Oh, hold on. No, give it to me now, ma'am. That's we need how you to. It's supposed to work, we sir. need you to put. You, we need to put you in the back of the vehicle. Why? It's safer for you. Look at my knee, dude. That's the only reason why I was. Fucking, look at it. Okay. Look at it. It's Angelina. split open, dude. Angelina. And this full split open my shit. Listen. Right here. Listen, ma'am. Check this out. Okay. How am I? You, how you am I under check this arrest? Out. Listen to me. Ow, bro. Angelina. Ow. Listen to me. We're not touching you, ma'am. Listen to please me. Please just. Please just okay. unhook me real quick. Okay. I won't. I won't. Okay. Well, listen run. to me. Okay, then stop talking. Me. Listen to me. Unhook me first. No. Unhook me first. That's not gonna happen. Look, okay. I'm not gonna run, bro. Where am I gonna go? You're under you arrest. already. Uh, okay, okay, fine, bro. Okay. I listen to that. You're under arrest. What for? What for? Because I have not drank four today. Times, okay. I have not drank today. Where okay. is my fucking license? What? Proof? Mike, watch her. Give me that. I'm gonna get shackles in case we do? need to use them. Get off the You got a 50 pound on the way? Okay. Okay, look, look, please. Right. Okay, I have not been driving. Listen to me, gonna, bro. Please just listen to me. Please, please, sir. Please, sir. I have not been driving under the influence today. You can give me my test now. Give me my blow test. I'm telling you, give me, give me my blow test now. Give me my blow test. You can see that I'm not under the, the office. Yeah, no, I need it now. Under my, under my like rights. Child, like no, under my rights, sir. When you pull me over, you have to give me a probable cause, you know? And guess what? You have it. You told me that I'm under the influence, but didn't give me no test. You need to give me a test first. And I have not done anything wrong. Under my, regards to my rights, yes, sir, I have a fucking cut that is split open. Two of them. Two of them. That's where these three butterfly stitches are sir okay Negative. and you have to give me my blow test first before you arrest me sir under are my you? rights under my are rights you, you sir can... no under my rights you need to give me my blow test we'll do it at the office all right we don't have a machine here no you are under, under my... arrest for driving under the influence how? of alcohol did how? you call an ambulance already yeah. how i have an ambulance how? coming out to how? check when on you you made me rip my stitches dude okay you made me okay. rip my stitches and i so... haven't done anything wrong Okay. Except trying to go home. I've been fucking just got off work. You can see my fucking t-shirt in there. In my fucking car. You can see my t-shirt in my car. I just got off of work. You didn't even give me a blow test. That's why I have to take it to the office. Why? Okay, wanna, and what? You're, you're gonna not arrest cooperating. Me you are under arrest. Okay, but you're going to arrest me then. What? And I wasn't drinking. And okay. I wasn't drinking, so when I get right. there and I do my blow test, we'll, we'll no, her, we'll, in regards to, to regardless. We'll, that's fine. Yeah. Just wait for the ambulance. No, so sir, in, I don't have a reason to stay and I have no reason to get any extra charges at all. Under my rights, I have not done anything wrong. You saw me and I told you, by law, hey, look, I have this right here and I have stitches right here and you want to put me in handcuffs right now. That is under my fucking rights of my rights right now that is bro i have not you need to give me a blow test before anything before you take me to the courts before you take me to jail well, the court's a long process for okay. Now, okay then I gotta fine take it to the office then on, first. under the jail there i have a you have no reason to not take here. me right now bro. not here okay i wasn't driving under the influence at all okay. at all bro so how the f you can predict that hey i'm under the influence okay. where's my blow test okay. All right, I let me tell you something, ma'am. First of all, you have to stop watching those cops. No, on K -pop. regardless, that's how not, do you know that I'm under that? that because what? Well, I works, told right? him that I'm going to be limping and it's going to... All gonna stuff watch on TV. No, and again, listen to me. I get that. I'm not no fucking cop watching 
fucking TV show person, bro. All right, well, the breathalyzer, the blow Listen, test is at the office. Where is the breathalyzer? At the office. at the office. No, at the office. I don't need it at the office. Okay, when you that. fucking arrest me, you need a probable cause to arrest me, and okay. there is none. What's the definition of probable cause, man? Yes, sir, and I've been doing rodeo, this for fucking doing. 12. And, and Helena. You're gonna go to jail. How? Okay? How, bro? I don't care how? what you tell me, you're gonna go to jail. How am I so going to done. jail? Okay, we're how done. How am I going to jail? And Helena. You need look to at me, Anna Lena. Look you need at me. To give me a breathalyzer. Anna Lena, look at me right here. My name is Sergeant Zimmerman. I am the supervisor okay. here on scene. I need a breathalyzer. Okay, right? are you going to listen to me? Are you giving me a breathalyzer? Are you going to listen to me, or are you going to keep talking? Are you I am the supervisor. You, I understand that. But I'm I trying still to need a breathalyzer. And I'm going to explain this because I'm not. Basically. Fantastic, outstanding. I'm going to explain no, that to you. Now, and I'm not going to go to the courts until I'm not okay. going to go into booking. Okay. Because Here's the deal. I've been pulled over for. I I'm gonna, you have not seen me jump would you let me office. answer your question? Okay, but listen though. I'm listening. All we have been doing is listening. I'm oh, trying to answer your question. You guys have ripped my fucking scriptures, well, bro. You, what do you, you mean? You've listened. Help me help you. I'm trying to help you, and you're not listening to me. You're thinking that I'm lying, bro. I know. Look. Yes, I, I know. I, yes, I, bro, I, know I know what you think, okay? Are you gonna let me? Are you gonna let me explain the process? I need a breathalyzer before you and arrest I, me. As of my fucking fourth and third amendment rights. Okay, you know yes, what? Sir. Okay, no, you need a we're not gonna have law school on the side of the no, road. Sir, the simple fact is, you are under what? arrest. What? You are going to jail what? tonight. For, we, we've Where already told you. We're gonna get you checked Where out on the with the ambulance right now. Okay, no, we're gonna take you to the station. You You'll have every opportunity to provide a breath sample. Do you understand? You guys have not okay. broke the law. No, sir, I don't understand. And you're okay. not going to take well, me. Yeah, we're, we're done. You guys we'll wait for the ambulance to check you out, then we're going to load you up and take you out. Me because I have not done anything wrong, sir. Okay. I have not done anything wrong. I, I tried. I tried to explain it to you. To I, I am listening. You're not, though. I, I, I have not done anything wrong. I told you that my knee is messed We've up. We've already told you. I can blast it open and you guys want to arrest me because what? Well, you I shouldn't stumbled. be drinking. Yeah. I wasn't drinking. drinking. Give me my breathalyzer. You well, can fucking see. We're going to go to the office. You can see that I wasn't oh. fucking drinking, bro. Okay. I drink at two. Okay. At two. What time is it right it's now? You know, it's 9 p.m. Yeah. It's uh, 9. It's 9. Angelina, it's the ambulance. Hours. Uh, Angelina, the ambulance is here. I suggest you be no, more cooperative with them right. than you are with us. What? No, I'm well, they're going to check you out. Because I need the breathalyzer. Well, first. yeah, we're going to take you to the office Sergeant, and we'll give you that. Sergeant, I need yeah. the breathalyzer right now. And we're going to take care of that for you. No, I need it right now. We don't have the machine here. Okay, I don't know what to tell you. Why are you guys arresting me? Because why it's a process. Why do you guys have to arrest me? Do you know why we're all, why three what of us are out? I'm trying to tell you. What probable well, cause? Well, will you let me tell you? I'll try to tell you. Okay, tell me then. What okay, probable cause? we got a call of a wrong way okay, driver. Who told you that? And they, where and when? And earlier, how? right before and we pulled you over. And how do you know it was me, bro? Because you were driving the wrong okay, way. You flipped the loop. Because I wasn't, bro. My I officer saw you. Sober this whole time. My officer saw you make a no, U-turn. You're wrong. Until right now. Okay. When I made a turn. Yes, sir. Because I was lost. Okay. I should get a fucking ticket for that. I should not be arrested for that, sir. Okay. No, wrong. All right. I'm not going anywhere. Okay. I'm not, and you do not have any right to give me any extra. Charges quit quit grabbing that branch. No, I'm not going to, sir. Let go of the branch. Care. You're going to hurt yourself. I'm Stop it. Gonna, you guys quit have acting like a child. Already. You guys Quiet. have already over nonsense, bro. Okay, you need to let go of that branch no. right now. No. Nope. Okay? You're, For what? You know what you're doing. You know what you're doing. Cut it out. Out of respect, bro, you should give me my breathalyzer right now. Come on, right let's go. Now. Get, no, give me my breathalyzer okay. right now. Okay, you got it. No, okay. Give me it right We're gonna now. check you out, but no. we gotta have you come up here, okay? No. Let me get on the other side. I'm not going. I'm not going. No, you need to give me. No, you need to give me my breathalyzer right now. Okay. okay. Ready? One, two, three. Let go. Right now. Okay, come on. Let's go. You need to give me my breathalyzer. Let's put it in the unit. You need to give me my breathalyzer, bro. Get right my stitches, dude. You guys want to? Yeah, wherever. Sit right here, man. Get away from the glass because she's hurting herself. Dead ass, dude. You guys have not given me a breathalyzer. We're going to take care of that for you. You guys haven't. Talk to him. I'm trying. Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. And it hurts, sir. They tighten my shit all fucking stupid and they make my fucking wrist hurt, bro. You have a flashlight? Yeah. I'm sorry, dude. What the fuck? Dude, I haven't done anything wrong. Deadass, give me my breathalyzer.
breathalyzer now. No, I'm not going anywhere and I'm not fucking moving anything until you give me my breathalyzer. Because I'm telling you right now, I have not been drinking. I have not been drinking. And I put that on my fucking life. I put that on my fucking dead father. You give me my breathalyzer now. No, regardless, when you pull me over, I know my rights. I know my rights as a citizen. So what do you guys want to do? Okay, they need to give me, no, speeches? they need to give me my rights first. Okay. They need to f***ing give me a f yeah, No, out. sir. Really? No, nope. I will it's bleed out. out. I will bleed out before anything. We just want to you need to give me my breathalyzer first, sir. Here, oh, okay. Once we get to I the office, my... we'll do that. Ow, no. Okay, well. You need to. For what? You need to tell me what the f*** I've done wrong now. And where is yeah. the proof that shown? I can tell you're going I'm, to jail, so. I, I don't want you to hurt yourself on this twig, okay? what? Why and for what? You, okay, and why and for what? Where, where have you seen me that I or took? What? I took a U turn? Oh, we're going to take her to hey. the station. Okay. No, you pulled me so over. It, it, yeah, I took over and I arrested you. Listen. Listen. Yes, sir. Oh, no. I don't know. Look, though. Look. Possible. Look at me. Here, but it looks bro, so what, so what do you look like it even No, look at me, bro. Look at me. Look at me. Okay. Well, hey. Are you good? Yes. You pulled me over. I'm not moving. To the hospital? Probably to the hospital. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why? Why, bro? Because you guys ripped my fucking stitches and I have not Why? You're the one who open. tossed yourself in the sticker bush, no, not I us. I didn't do shit. Yeah, I was already did. bleeding when you guys pulled me out of my fucking car. What do you mean, dude? You were already bleeding? I was. Yes, sir, I was. That's so, why I was so rushing I'm home. I'm, I cut you. That's also why I was rushing fucking home because okay. you guys grabbed me. All right. Okay. Why would I? I get some why? What game yeah. would I get yeah. out of this? What know. game would I get out of lying? Yeah. Hey, do you, Officer, do you want him to check your vitals? No, make, make sure I you're... want him to tell me what the f*** I'm being arrested oh, for. We're, uh, we're done. Yeah. Uh, Sir, if she no. doesn't want to be seen, we're going to have to take her. Right. We're, Sir, done. We're, no. we're done playing your games. I don't okay? regret what. Load her up. I, all day to do I this. need yeah. a breathalyzer we're done. first. Yeah, we're, we're going to go check care of that no, for you. I Thanks, guys. Thank you. All right. Thank you guys, okay. All right, guys. Okay. Come on, let's go. Which unit? This one? Yours? In the back of my unit. For what, I already sir? told you ten times. I need a breathalyzer. Okay. Come on. No, I don't, I don't, come on, Angelina. Let's go. Come on. I need a breathalyzer. Come on. Let's go. Oh, yeah, we, come on. Come on. Rights, We're going to take no, care of that. I need come on. Let's go. Let go. Let yeah. go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. We don't want to hurt you. We don't want to do this. Come on. Look. And look. You guys are yeah. supposed to give me a breathalyzer yeah. first. You're a bitch's vehicle. We're going to okay. charge you. No, you guys are going to damage my fucking stitches, yeah. bro. We're resisting. I wasn't okay. resisting. Son of a gun. Yeah, I'm all right. Yeah, okay, I'll I'll tow this. Jesus. Four eleven so come. Four eleven. Four eleven, be advised, uh ten forty one is ten fifteen at this time. Being extremely Last time I was with the cop, they broke like tried to break into my phone. Like I, listen, I know a lot more about this than you do, okay? So, picture this. It's April 29th, 2023, and an officer pulls over a Karen because she's cruising in the dark without her headlights, which is such a dumb Karen thing to do. Anyways, the officer rolls up and immediately gets the vibe that Karen might be a little off. And guess what? She straight up confesses that she was puffing on the magic dragon just two hours ago, if you know what I mean. Here's how the rest of the night went for this smoked up Karen. Hey, how you doing? Yeah. I'm good. I'm Deputy L. Sheriff's Office. Come here and talk to me real quick. You understand why uh, Deputy Mandalay stopped you? Oh, uh, yeah. He said my headlight was out. Your I didn't know it was. I thought it was just my brights. Just your brights? Yes. Okay, I gotcha. And I haven't had time because I worked 91 hours last week. Holy sh**. That's a lot. Yeah. yeah. Um, when was the last time you smoked? Like two hours ago. Like two hours ago? Okay, because your pupils are like massive. Well, I just have anxiety. You got anxiety? All right, well, take a deep breath for me. All right, cool. So I just want to make sure that you're safe to operate a motor vehicle, okay? Yeah. All right, cool. So would you allow me to check your eyes and do a couple other things, stuff like that? All right, so first things first, I just want to look at your eyes real fast. Go ahead and place your feet together for me. All right, take your hands and place them down to the side. What color is uh, the tip of the pen? Red. All right, so follow the red tip. With your eyes, your eyes only. Don't move your head. You understand? All right, just close your eyes for me real quick. All right, you're good. All right, go ahead and open your eyes. See the red light? Again, it's going to go around your face twice in a circle, this time coming towards the bridge of your nose. Look at it the whole time for me, okay? 
You want me to follow it? Yep. Oh, it's right here. What'd you say? I said I'm just nervous because I had a really bad encounter with the pop monster. I got you. Well, I'm just trying to make sure you're safe to drive, like I said. All right, so during the exercise, it's nine steps down the line, touching heel to toe, not stepping off the line, keeping your hands down at your side, looking down at your feet, counting your steps out loud. All right, do you have any questions? All right, whenever you're ready, you can begin the exercise. Go this is I explained, yes, ma'am. Just like, just like I explained, I can't give you any direction during the exercise. Okay. Next thing I want you to do is I'm going to have you take either foot, right or left, the foot of your choice, whichever one you want, okay? I'm going to have you hold that foot approximately six inches off the ground, just like this. Keeping your hands down at your side and your head looking down the toe of your raised foot, I want you to count out loud. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand, so on and so forth until I tell you to stop, okay? Do you have any questions? So, I just take my foot up, whichever one I want, mm -hmm. and count one, one thousand until you say stop. But if I drop it, I just pick it back up and keep going. Yes, ma'am. Oh. You can begin the exercise. Remember to look at your foot the whole time. You can stop there. Oh All right. So, I do have a couple questions to ask you, okay? Yes. Sir. All right. Prior to asking any questions, I do have to read your Miranda rights. It does not mean you're under arrest, okay? It just means I want to talk to you about your night, what's going on. Yes, sir. Obviously, smoking some things like that the whole night okay mm -hmm. all right why are my legs hurt and that was, i'm not yeah, no worries all right so listen to me real quick okay so calissa you do have the right to remain silent anything you say can will be used against you in the court of law all right do you understand why i just read to you yeah. all right cool having your rights in mind will you answer a couple questions for me yes sir. all right cool. what time do you get to work today um probably like three fifty. okay all right what time do you get off um, probably around like 8.30ish. 8.30? Alright, what time do you think it is right now? Like 10, almost, around okay. 10. It's 10.30. Alright, so if you got off at 8.30 and it's 10.30, what'd you do in between then? Um, during the rush, we went out and that's whenever we had and I went and back in, did all my closing stuff and then we all hung outside and now I left for work. I mean to come home from I'm, I'm confused. Okay, so you got, what time, so you clocked out of work at 8.30? I got done with all my stuff, so that's when we went out. Like, all the tables were done, we stopped taking them. Gotcha. Where'd you guys go out to? There's like a little side patio. Okay, cool. And you, so you were just hanging out there? Yeah. For the last two hours? No, not there. We went and sat in the car after. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. All right, now you're headed home? Yes, sir. So, uh, earlier you told me and Deputy Mandalay, so you smoked a little bit of much when it was that when you smoked it was after 8 30 in between the 10 30 area like right at eight eight ish okay cool was it like a blunt bowl it was like a little joint. little joint all right cool. um so have you had anything to drink tonight any alcoholic beverages no i have a uh, sobriety thing that i take every couple of hours oh okay like uh you have to blow into it all right cool. um so you understand though that marijuana can be impairing as well correct Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah, All right. I'm almost having my med card. I have the appointment for it. Gotcha. I don't like taking it. I understand. When's the last time you had something to eat? Um, at work. Huh? At work. A What'd you eat? salad. Okay. And I ate before that. Cedar salad. What time? Um, we were probably around like salads. when I got there. Like so like three? Five, maybe. Okay. I got there at three. Gotcha. All right, so honest question. Would you say you feel any of the effects of the marijuana you, you've used? The effects? Like, any of the impaired? effects? Yeah, do you feel any of the effects of the marijuana you've used? No, I 
it would make, I would usually just smoke it before I go to bed so I can be calm and my you know, I'm, mind not right as soon go to sleep. But I'm just really nervous because last time I was with a cop, they broke, like tried to break into my phone and like trash my car and all this other stuff and it was a really bad. Did you get arrested previously? Yes. No, my friends got into a fight on the beach and um, they called the cops. So the cops came and I was drinking at the time of that. And uh -huh. They arrested me for that, but after they did, they went and found my phone and keys and took it a to-go box from my car and threw my phone in it and shook it up with sand and cracked it. And there's like a voicemail of them doing all that. Uh, that's this makes me... Gotcha. Well, we're not going to do all that to you, okay? I do have one more question to ask you, okay? Um, on a scale of 1 to 10, okay, 1 being stone cold sober, so you have not used any marijuana at all. 10 being like the most you've ever been, where would you put yourself on a scale? Probably a zero, because... I'd have to like, I have a higher tolerance, so it, since it was so long ago, I would, I usually would when I go home to go to bed. Gotcha. All right, well, listen, listen, do me a favor, okay? Go ahead and place your hands behind your back. Right now, you already been placed under arrest for DUI. I do think that your normal faculties are impaired, okay, on the marijuana. All right, place your hands together for me real quick. Place, just place your hands for me. If you pulled that, her jacket up for me. How, because you showed signs of impairment on all the exercises, okay? All right. So I'm just having anxiety attack. Like, I can feel my heart rate increase. Okay, well, that's not an anxiety attack. Can you redo the test? No, not this time. Okay, so here's the deal. If not, though, you can check the security cameras at my work. You have not what? Smoked in hours. Understand that marijuana is a lasting impairment, okay? It's, it's really not, not though. Yes, I it is. Redo the, like, right, listen, I know a lot more about this than you do, okay? Come on over here for me and have a seat for me real fast, all right? This right. was for my headlights not being in. Okay, well, during the, that's the reason for the traffic stop. During the traffic stop... Please, I've worked every day this week. I'm just tired, and okay. I am Come over here and have having a seat an anxiety me. attack. Can you please call my mom? Delta 4174. How old are you? Please, 19. All right, come please over here. Please do not. All right, come have please. a seat for me real fast. Please. Come have a seat for me real fast. I'm literally... Please let me please redo it. Please. please. I'm just I'm having an anxiety have attack. I feel my me. heart rate. Can you sit down? Like, y'all can call a doctor. Like No, have a seat. It doesn't... Have a seat, and we'll talk to you about it, okay? Please. Sit down. I literally worked 91 hours. You know how hard that is on a child. Hey, you have to sit. Y'all have to literally feel that I'm shaking and nervous and cold, and, like, I can redo the test. I will calm down, just call, okay. get, I have a seat get my me. medicine or something. We'll, we'll, we'll work on that. Have a seat for me, okay? Watch just your foot. Don't leave, close the door. I'll I have take to close, your I have to close the it's door. It's going to make my anxiety so much. Please. Just hang tight for me. Can I have to close the door. Just stay here with it open, please? Just hang tight for me one second. I gotta close the door. We'll sit inside and talk to you, okay? I promise. Huh? No. It, it, hey, 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 hey. Okay, so. Okay. So, yeah, marijuana impairment doesn't last for just an hour. That's. I know so. 100%. So, I'm a drug recognition expert. I'm a certified expert in the court on impairment. Okay? Marijuana impairment lasts, peak high lasts two to four hours with lasting effects up to 24 hours. No. No. All right. So, hey, we're going to ask that you, did you get arrested for a DUI or something? Then why, I thought you said you had, I thought you said you had to blow into a uh, breathalyzer thing every couple hours. Where, it's in your car? It's in your purse? Oh. So listen, when we get to the jail, we're going to ask you to submit to a urine sample. Is that something you'd be willing to do for us? To determine the chemical or controlled substances in your body, it's part of what happens when you get arrested for DUI. The roadside field sobriety exercises. I already did. We've already done it. What's your health concern? No, it's not a health concern. It's 75 degrees outside. There, but there is. 
Like, I'm 100% telling you there is. Oh, no, it's going to get towed. Uh, I, I'm sorry, there's literally nothing we can do about that. I'm not going anywhere yet. Just in case. I think I'm a bad driver or something. Jesus. No, this was not You feel targeted? Okay. Please learn me how you feel targeted. You did get a DUI. Same shit. They want the since it was on my insurance, they want to take me off of it. Because they're different from the process. How many DUIs have you got, girl? You've been arrested twice for DUI. Yeah, the, it's the the breath test is relevant. Uh, no, I knew you. Would. You just got arrested. You just got arrested like three days ago, uh, like a month ago. What'd you get arrested for a month ago? So are you out on bond right now? Huh? Are you sure? You're going to have to post bond to get out of jail for, for the battery charge? They ROR'd you? Interesting. Intriguing. Very intriguing. Yeah, I feel itchy. I feel very itchy. <laughs> Stop itching. You're making me itchy. Hey, you know you got roaches in your car? That's disgusting, and it's freaking me out. I'm gonna punch you. <laughs> I should just stand outside. Uh, right. Because <laughs> it doesn't work like that. Because when you're arrested for DUI, the car gets towed, that's why. Uh, right. So we're just supposed to give you a free pass. Did you know that marijuana? Did you know that marijuana use elevates your blood pressure, your heart rate? Oh, that's right. The doctors. Word. I had no idea. Hey, does your mom work at the airport? I remember the last time you got arrested. I was there. Huh? Uh, the last time you got arrested for DUI. I remember. What's up? I got a cooperative female. Where is the old John's guy? Is eighty-three years old. <laughs> That's so sad. Blue two times legal limit. Almost two and a half times legal Damn, limit. Damn, he came rowdy though. Getting lit. Yeah. Probably had enough of his wife after being married to her for fifty years. While she wasn't the worst Karen in the world, she definitely was one of the dumbest. The good news is that now she at least has a DUI to go with her DWI so they can keep each other company.